Hey everybody, guess what time it is? It's my favorite time of the month. I've got my September Short Par 4 Executive Box. Um, so I just want to share with you guys what I got this time. Um, let's dig in. Alright, right off the bat, you can tell this is going to be a US Open theme. US Open just wrapped up today. Um, congratulations, DeChambeau. Um, it's funny because they gave a poker chip with him as the Hulk. I think it was last month. So, um, Cool. Right off the bat, i got this US Open hat right here. Um, a little three-leaf three leaf clover on the back. Uh, U.S. Open 2020 winged foot. Like I said, it's probably going to be a lot of things related to the U.S. Open this time. Um, it's a new era hat. Fitted cap. Pretty nice hat. I don't know with the, the plaid if that's really my thing, but it's pretty cool. You guys take a look at it. Pretty nice hat. Let's see what else we got. Got some uh, USGA literature. Victory Club, USGA, SP4 Text. I don't know if you guys are aware, they do have a new thing where they, if you sign up, they can send you, they'll send you a text every like Wednesday with some deals. Um, I do it just because it can't hurt, you know, I check it out. I haven't purchased anything yet. I think it's maybe four or five of them have gone out so far, but it's been some good stuff if you are looking for specific things like a new bag or you know, some shoes, things like that. So check it out if you want, uh, SP4 Text. Dot com. Uh, let's see. All right, got a lot of little things in here. Got a uh, pitch mark tool with a ball marker on it. Uh, it's like you know, a pretty decent one. Uh, it's obviously branded for short par four, but uh, you know, it's, it's pretty solid. It's got some heft to it, so I think it's magnetic as well um, at the top, but also for the ball marker. So pretty solid. You know, it's not going to be one of those little flimsy ones. It's not going to break. Uh, it's also got a bottle opener for those when the round gets good. Um, nice. You can always use more of these, uh, especially when you have people in the family and they're just starting to play golf. So that'll definitely go out there. Back another uh, sleeve of the Soft Response Tailor Made Balls. Uh, I haven't had a chance to play with the ones I got last month. Uh, they seem like they're pretty decent. You know, they're not the top line of the ball. Top line. Uh, balls, but they're uh, probably that mid-tier. So, you know, when you're not playing super well, it's not mid-season, mid-form, so these are probably good ones to use. Um, looking forward to trying them out. I meant to, you know, chip or putt with them a little bit, uh, just to see if I can tell you guys, you know, what they felt like, but they're supposed to be somewhat soft, so... Um, anyway, you can always use, like I said last time, you can always use more balls. Uh, poker chip this month. It's a U.S. Open with a short par 4 on the back, so again, I'll show a close-up of it. But these are always fun to collect as well. What else do we have in here? Alright. Um, looks like some sort of pouch or bag. Let's take a look. Gotten like a shoe bag and some other things from me. This, this is actually from short par 4 in the spring, so, uh, let's see, it's a little, um, pouch, uh, felt lined, maybe it's, uh, valuables, there's an inside pocket as well, so, um, not sure of the specific use, uh, but it's got a clip on it, and, um, you can put it in the bag or outside the bag, I'm not really sure, but, you know, it's nice and soft on the inside, keep your valuables, um, Maybe your uh, your rangefinder you carry some golf balls in it. Um, but a nice little pouch. I'm sure my daughter can find a use for it as well. <laughs> she likes to collect things. Um, looks like a U.S. Open collection shirt, t-shirt, I think. Let's see. U.S. Open shirt, uh, winged foot, long sleeve, clearly. 
Um, has a nice, nice feel. I don't know if it's 100% cotton or what, but uh, let's see what it's made of. But it feels pretty soft. It's, it's thin, but it feels pretty nice. Uh, it's got the winged foot logo on the sleeve, the front, um, and the back. I guess they're identical. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we got the 2020, uh, the wonderful number there. But uh, looks like they maybe had the names of the different holes. Um, Winged Foot, New York. Um, thought I saw a date on there. June 18th to the 21st. I think it was the original date. Now it's been postponed to this past weekend. But uh, pretty cool. I don't know if that's a <laughs> collector's thing now that the, the date is wrong. But... Uh, it's a pretty neat shirt, actually. I, I like it. It says enjoy the walk on the sleeve on the other side. So, yeah, it feels really nice, though. Nice and soft. Um, be a good thing to, to wear underneath. You know. And the last item I see is another U.S. Open Winged Foot Volunteer Collection. Um, this is Ralph Lauren. Um, looks like maybe a jacket. So... Yeah, nice navy blue jacket. Uh, again, got the winged foot logo on it. Yellow zipper, solid navy blue. Ralph Lauren. Pretty nice. I think the volunteer edition. Maybe this is what the you know people helping out are wearing on the course as well. That's pretty nice. Uh, nice lightweight jacket, windbreaker. Uh, I don't know if it's rainproof or not, but it's pretty nice. Yep, water repellent. Apparently packable. Um, I guess that's a reflective strip for all the ventilation for rain. That's a pretty nice jacket, actually. Pretty pleased with that. Um, you know, again, the this is the executive box. Um, they have uh, a fairway one that starts out at fifty dollars a month with I think five or six dollars shipping. This is the hundred dollar box. Um, this is the loud and wild or wild and proud. Um, I think I'm gonna switch back to the athletic uh, for the next one, um, but um, yeah, they have a few different options just to kind of fit everyone's different personalities. Um, and I like to do these videos too because um, you get to kind of see the variety that people might get in the same month, just based on their you know their choice in styling um, and just the variety that they'll send out too. So, uh, but this month, you know, a lot of it seems like everybody's getting U.S. Open stuff. Um, no surprise here. They also had a a tour edition box that they were offering at the beginning of the month for US Open. I didn't opt for that. Um, I'm not too surprised that more items came uh, for this. But let's see, you know, again, the retail value is usually much more than uh, what you pay for it. I'm trying to find something for the jacket. Um, having a hard time. But yeah, I'd say the jacket is probably, you know. 60 to $100 retail, right? And then the shirt they list at $42 retail. You know, I'm sure it would cost that much if a gift shop, you know, whatever, if you're at the tournament. Um, you know, again, retail is a little, probably inflated a little bit. So, I mean, you got the pouch and the hat's probably $30, $32 retail. So, um, I'm not sure about the hat still. Maybe it'll grow on me. Tell me guys, tell me guys what you think. Sorry guys, real amateur hour here. Uh, my memory card ran out of space, so it cut off. Anyway, uh, I was just about done. Um, you can kind of see here um, the collection from this, this month's box. Um, for those that uh, aren't subscribers, um, if you're interested, you can save $25 with this uh, coupon code that I've got um, down below in the link. And if you guys liked it, give me a, give me a thumbs up. Um, but uh, yeah. Let me know what you guys think of some of the stuff. Uh, in particular, I'm interested in thoughts on the hat. Um, maybe not quite my style, but maybe it'll grow on me. Who knows? Um, but thanks, guys, for, for watching. And uh, be kind. Love one another. And uh, look forward to seeing you guys next month.